Okay, so back at it again. Healthy. Yeah. Feeling good. Yeah, feeling good. How's it like that? It's been good. I mean, I'm just happy I'm able to be here and able to compete. So everything's great for me right now. And have you moved here already? No. You, not you're not yet. here yet? No, not still, yet? You're still in Minnesota. Yep. When do you move down? 11th. June 11th? Yep. So in a week? Yeah. Go back home, week there, graduate, then come right back up. So school's not even out yet? No. I've been done for a while, but like our class. Oh, graduates. the graduation, the ceremony. Yeah, ceremony. Okay. So, uh, what, what's your last year look like for someone that, that hasn't been following along? Last year of high school? Like last year in general, the like past 12 months. Where, where have you been wrestling? What have your injuries been? Because you know you've, you've yeah. had a pretty crazy year. Uh, so. The end of the so last year, right after Junior World Team Trials, like a week out of Junior Worlds, I like tore my ACL. So I was rehabbing that for like four months. Wrestled the high school season, then like a six month mark, went out to Russia, had a match there, and then the second match I actually retore my ACL. So like since then, it's been a couple months now, like a few months, just been rehabbing it. Getting back to good, and now I'm here. So you don't have an ACL? No, 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 not right now. How is is that presented? Any kind of problems whatsoever, or what's the? Feel great, feeling good. Do you get it fixed, or is it just just we're just going with it, or what? Yeah, what do you? Just, just that's going. it. Yeah. It's going with it. Yeah, for sure. So, because we're looking for some all-time greatest matchups here in the next three years between you and your fellow. Yeah, I'll be good. Yeah. Right? I'll Between be good. you and Gable, which is, I think, going to be the greatest rivalry maybe in the history of college. You know, we have Zahid, Mark Hall right now, but I think it could shape up to be that. How do you feel about that? And is that something you think about or just whoever's in front of me? You never, I mean, you never know. Whatever's in God's plan, if it turns out to be a great rivalry, so be it. That'll be fun. So Jordan Woods, a really big heavy. Uh, how much are you weighing nowadays, and, and how was you know getting your miss on a guy like that? Uh, I think I weighed in at 100 kilos, so I'm not too big right now. Let me get bigger, but just like just I've never really wrestled at heavyweight or with a whole lot of heavyweight, so to get out here, grab some of these guys, see where I stack up, confidence builder, feels good. He's all American this year for Lehigh, right? Yep, and so. and you're a high school senior still technically, right? So we obviously have a pretty good measuring stick for you. Um, and obviously you, Coach Ryan, and the staff at Ohio State got to talk. But go next year, don't go next year. When does that determination get made? Or is that the discussion with the staff? How you are in the room? Red shirt. Red shirt. Red shirt. Yep. Red shirt. Yeah. Gonna red shirt. Get bigger, stronger. Yeah. But no new ACL in the red shirt year. No. That just, you're gonna rock it. I like it. Feeling good. I like it. it. Hasn't hindered me, so. What did this tournament teach you about where you're at? Um, taught me that if my head's right, I'm feeling good, I can compete with anybody I set my mind to, I believe. I mean, it's up to those guys to prove me wrong, but that's where I believe I stand, that I can compete with most good, anybody in the way. So, so you're redshirting, so does that mean you're definitely going to go to U23s? U23s. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, I'll go talk to the coaches, see what they have in store, but I mean, made the team, might as well go, so yeah. World Championship, you know, what What do you got to do to, you know, get in a position to pick some foreigners up, put them on their heads, you know, and, and not let them lull you sleep like they do, some international travel, you know, there's a lot that goes into it, but what do you got to do to bring home a gold? Uh, I mean, what I gotta do is listen to my coaches, work hard in the wrestling room, weight room, live a good life on and off the mat. I mean, be healthy, not going out, not staying out late, just doing the right thing at every day, every second of the day. So, Gable might have the opportunity to challenge you for this spot. Would you welcome that? Yeah. Would you look forward to that? Yeah. He's got the right challenge. Going back to the knee for a minute. What went into the decision not to get another repair? Uh, I mean, after the first surgery, the second surgery is never as good as the first surgery. And it's like, I had already built all the muscle back up for the most part. So it's like, well, I have the surgery, lose all my muscle. And plus, I just like to compete. So the sooner I could do that, the better. This whole uh, 
college decision thing that went back and forth and yeah. commit, decommit, yeah. you know, how glad are you that that whole thing's over and it's behind you and you're going to go to Ohio State's going to be home and yeah. how good does it feel to know where you're going is? It's the greatest facility in the world, no question, right? But how good does it feel and, and are there some things where, you know, Oklahoma State's on the schedule, that might be something. Minnesota, obviously, I don't know if that was an option, obviously, you know, with, with Gable and your size, but... Being knowing Ohio State's going to be the spot and, and, and that whole experience, what was that like for you? I mean, regardless of what happened, I, some things happened at certain schools. I mean, so I made my decision. I mean, I feel like Ohio State at the end of the day was the best place for me. Throughout this whole college decision, I looked at things, I learned a lot. And I mean, I think I grew as a person just dealing with people. So, I mean, I feel really good about Ohio State. I feel good about my decision. Congratulations, man. Thank you.